One of the best pieces of advice that I've ever received as a woman in business is to be the CEO of you. And what that means is to be an active participant in your journey. It means to just not allow things to happen to you, make them happen for you. Make sure you raise your hand for work that maybe isn't necessarily in your job description. You never know where that's going to lead. And always remember, your life isn't your work and your work isn't your life. My advice to younger women wanting to get into a corporate atmosphere, business, or even just in general, is to make your voice heard. Being emotional doesn't mean that you're being irrational. Being driven and intelligent doesn't make you a teacher's pet. And striving for what you want in life, no matter what that is, makes you a powerful woman. Well, I think the real answer is all voices, diversity of voices are important in the workplace, in our communities, uh, in every facet of our lives. And the key there is diversity. And in uh, science and technology, uh, women's voices tend to be a minority one because there are fewer women in those career fields. So why is our voice important? Uh, because we bring diversity to the table in those contexts, because uh, there aren't as many of us. We need female voices to inspire younger generations to pursue their passions and drive innovation, not only in the IT industry, but in every industry and every office across the globe. Having female voices in the workplace shows inclusivity and unity within a corporate atmosphere. It is an exciting time to be a woman in business, especially now. As organizations work to be more inclusive, there's this overwhelming demand for women to lead, for women to help cultivate the organization, for women to have the direct impact to develop the potential in others. And the great thing that we do as women when we assume these positions of power is we lift as we climb. We create opportunities for women who come behind us. Once you establish that you're there to, to work hard, to be a part of the team, to do your piece of the puzzle, to lend your perspective, um, to be a team player, all those things that people want from a colleague. Um, once you've established that, I think people are very welcoming of teammates, um, you know, male or female. More and more you're seeing women stepping into leadership positions that have been traditionally held by men. It's really great to see how these days women are making sure that everybody's voices are being heard.